Hey, what's going on YouTube? So today, uh, just a quick video on how to use catch in focus on a Pentax camera, because there are some settings that need to be enabled or catch in focus will not work, such as back button focus, um, has to be a manual lens or a lens that has a manual focusing switch on the lens itself. The camera needs to be in autofocus mode. So I'll just show you exactly what needs to be done for you to be able to use catch in focus. All right, so I'm going to be showing this uh, using my personal camera, Pentax K3. Uh, mounted to the camera, I've got my Sigma 1770 f2.8 to 4 DC macro HSM. <sighs> yeah, that, that name needs to be shortened. Anyway, uh, so what you're going to need to do, and this is pretty much uh, for any lens that you actually use uh, for catch and focus. So what you're going to need to do is over here is the autofocus and manual focus switch. So you need to move this from autofocus to manual focus or mount a completely manual focus lens to the camera. Now the actual autofocus button or autofocus switch on the camera needs to stay on autofocus. The reason being is it uses the autofocus module to know when uh, to enable the catch and focus uh, triggering for the shutter to go off. Now, the part a lot of people get wrong is when you get into the menu. So in the menu itself, uh, you need to go into uh, like some of the settings here and you want to go to button customization. At least that's how it is on uh, the K3. And within these options, you go to the autofocus button. Now on the autofocus button, you have a few different settings. Now cancel autofocus, uh, so the shutter release button is disabled. Catch and focus will not work. You need to have the shutter button enabled uh, for focusing. Now uh, same with AF2, autofocus with shutter release button is disabled, so you only use the rear autofocus button here. Catch and focus will not work. You need to have autofocus performed when the autofocus button is pressed. Now, what that means is, at least with the K3, you never actually end up disabling uh, the rear autofocus button. So if I switch this back to autofocus, and I'll turn this on to live view so you can see, and uh, I'll just focus on something. I know it's kind of glary here, but let me zoom in. So I'm using the rear autofocus button here, back button focus. Okay, and now I will not use that and I'll just use the shutter button. Okay, so the shutter button has to be enabled no matter what. Um, now, the other thing I noticed as well is catch and focus will not work in live view. I know, it's ridiculous, but that's just how it is. Uh, I guess it only works on phase detect autofocus and not contrast. So, it's kind of difficult for me to show how this will work. Um, let me see here. Let me get this completely blurred out. Alright, so I'll get that blurred out and I'll hopefully keep that... Correct. Now I'm going to press the shutter button down all the way. All the way. And I will start manually focusing. And there we go. And let's see what happened. There you go. That's pretty much it. So those are all the settings you need in order to enable catch and focus on a Pentax camera. 